Hi, I'm Christian. Welcome back to another On The Road video brought to you by AppliantVideo.com. Stop. Before beginning any repair, always be sure to disconnect the power to the appliance. It is also recommended to test the outlet for proper voltage. Today we're working on a top mount estate refrigerator. The customer's complaint is that the fresh food section isn't cooling properly and the freezer section has frost built up and uh, items are starting to defrost in the freezer. So uh, we've already tested the defrost heater and defrost thermostat. Uh, the last thing that uh, uh, is in the circuit we'll say is the actual defrost control board. So uh, that's located in the fresh food section. So to begin the repair, we're gonna be re replacing that uh, control. The tools you will need to complete this repair are a number two Phillips screwdriver and a quarter inch nut driver. To open the fresh food door and uh, uh, gain access to the actual control panel. Before we drop down the console assembly here, uh, we are going to remove the two Phillips screws. They're number two Phillips screws that actually secure the actual uh, defrost control board in place. So uh, we're gonna re remove both screws. Once both screws have been removed, we can remove the one quarter inch screw that secures the actual control panel to the top of the actual fresh food section. So it's located right here in the middle towards the front. Once that screw has been removed, the whole assembly here will drop down. We'll pull it towards us to remove it from those two tabs and take a hold of the defrost control board. And it has two mullet connectors that are, have all spade terminals where it connects onto. So we're gonna remove both connections by pulling straight off. Sometimes these connections, if they've been sitting long enough, uh, will be a little tight. Just like that. Here's our old defrost control board. We'll set it aside so we can install the new one. Now that we have our new defrost control board, let's install it. To begin the installation of the new defrost control board, uh, we're gonna line up uh, both connectors here. And uh, now they are, color co they are color coded. They are also keyed to fit only one way. So we're gonna line up the, uh, the white and the brown here and push it directly on. And then we'll do the four wire connector and push it directly on. Once both connections are on securely, we can now uh, secure the actual control board to the console assembly by re-securing it with the two Phillips screws we removed earlier. So we're just gonna line it up here on the bottom. So once the control is secured, we can now reroute the thermostat right here in the open slot and slide the two open tabs across the prongs on the top. And then we can re-secure the actual control panel assembly with the quarter inch screw we removed earlier. We can now close the door and return the power and this will complete our repair. Thank you for watching another quality in-home repair video brought to you by appliancevideo.com.